Hi, <laughs> this is Bid Private TV, we're with Jean-Pierre. How are you doing? You must be really exhausted, really stressed, but you look really kind of calm and ready for drink. Everyone says that. Like, uh, I'm a bundle of nerves deep down inside, but yeah, no, I'm, I'm elated. I'm calm now that the show's over. It's absolute mayhem here today. I'm quite surprised London Fashion Week has been so intense and so recognised globally now than what it has been those few seasons before. Uh, talk to me about your collection. Uh, the collection beneath this is really based on my, my relationship with this uh, artist, this Ukrainian artist, Zineda Lehechiva. And it was really just that, that dialogue, that relationship, you know, discussing the creative process. Um, with her and just designing clothes that would really incorporate her and her lifestyle. So have you been working her as, with a muse with you on this yeah, collection? Well this is like she's genuinely become a muse and I've never really had one living like woman to really like I, I'm always designed for every woman but it was one in particular that was, it was just a great process to actually one find a muse and two really like have that discourse and that uh, relationship it's amazing. You have slight injections of colour coming into your collection, mainly it's black and white. Talk to me about the injection of colour. Uh, well, normally, like I, I think in black, I operate in black, but um, I always choose one particular colour to really f to be within the frame of the blackness. And uh, this season, like no, yeah, there is an aqua, there there is like a splash of red and and like cobalt blue, and I just use these colours really just to canvas and and like, have a great relationship with the black and white. Right. Good to see you. Go and have a drink. This is Fish 5 TV. Jean-Pierre Briganza show, wasn't it great, Daniel? Talk to me about it and what you thought. It was amazing. The silhouettes were beautiful, the colours, the patterns, the prints, just amazing. I loved it. What do you think about London Fashion Week this season? Um, well, it's only just begun, but um, it seems uh, a, a lot more kind of emptier. I'm not sure why, but uh, it does. It seems a little bit lack of celebrities. I hate to say it, but it does seem a little bit lack this season. Um, I think there's some to come. I'm not sure. Good, let's hope it's the first day and everyone's getting their beauty sleep ready for tomorrow. Daniel, talk to me about your look. Uh, today I'm wearing um, a Birkin, uh, a ba uh, I don't know, a burka, um, but I've took the thing off. I made this earlier, a few rings, you know. When you say you made it earlier, what, like this afternoon or something you've been creating? I made it earlier. <laughs> <laughs> Um, talk to me about Sauropol, that's coming up very soon. Yes, uh, Sauropol show is 19th of October. Um, it's coming up, I can't tell you what it's about, but it's going to be good. Great. We're going to be there. Love to see Daniel Lismore, we love him, he's great, looks amazing. We're going to catch you in 55 TV.